Hey babes, it's Demi B. Welcome to my channel. As you can see, we're still in my bedroom. We're not on a beach. We're not taking a hike through the rainforest. We're not laying poolside <laughs> with a mojito in my hand. We're not on a rooftop pool having dinner. We're here. So I hope you've been able to find some travel deals this summer. In Maryland, we have these cicadas flying around. So I can't even like go out back on my deck to escape and have a cocktail. So I'm stuck indoors for the most part. But, well, I did have a couple trips. One trip to Dallas and I missed my flight, no fault of mine. And it was a direct flight that would have got me there 8 o'clock in the morning. And they tried rescheduling me and I wouldn't have gotten there until 11 p.m. at night. So I, I made the executive decision just to cancel it because it was only going to be a 48-hour trip. So that was going to make me miss a full day. Then last week, I found a flight deal with United to Brazil. I hopped on it. I purchased the flight. I got an email yesterday that United canceled my whole itinerary. And it was like a really good flight. Got me there in like 10 hours, plane change. No, 12 hours with a plane change. So they canceled my whole itinerary. They really didn't give me any options to rebook. They were just like, you have to go online if you would like to rebook to see your options. I go online, the flight is double the time, like literally 24 hours and 20 hours to get there. And they're not honoring my original price. And that was a really good steal, like $500. Like, you cannot beat it. Now, I would have to have pay like maybe an extra $200 each way. So I had to make the decision again to cancel that flight. So I'm in the mindset of, I don't wanna have to force anything. I have a list of places that I would love to go to, I'd love to visit. And if a flight deal comes my way, then I book it. But if it doesn't work, then it doesn't work. It goes back on the list and hopefully, you know, maybe in a couple months or next year, I will get to Brazil. But that's heartbreaking. I really wanted to go. I already started looking at hotels and everything. Um, and I'm also upset because Spirit had a really good deal to El Salvador, which is on my list, and it would have been two hundred dollars. But the deal was during the same time that um, I would be going in Brazil, so I could not take that deal. And I had a flight credit. I have like a three hundred dollar flight credit with Spirit from my Dallas flight that I had to dag on cancel. So that flight comes back around. I'm, I'm on it every day. Your girl will um, be in El Salvador. I've already peeped out places <laughs> to stay. A four hour direct flight from BWI, yes, perfection. But let me get into <laughs> the topic of today. My most watched video on my channel is four ways to style a bikini to make it a bralette. You guys seem to love that. So I thought let's recreate it for the summer, put some bright fun colors in it. And for all you babes out there that may be traveling soon, then and you're a little top heavy like me, give you some styles with so you can recreate this look for yourself. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to share with you um, my bikini choice. Now this one is gonna be coming from ASOS and I have the full swimsuit this time, not just the bikini top. So I'm gonna share with you the full swimsuit. So if you wanna get this look, cause it's perfection and it holds the girls up. Now if you need the support, run and get this swimsuit. And then I'm gonna show you a couple looks from going out to get breakfast, some casual, some dressy, and some dinner looks that you can create with this bikini to create it and make it a bralette for you. So let's get into the look.
So, I love the pink blazer look so much. I'm gonna wear it to run errands. <laughs> I'm gonna wear my clothes. I'm not gonna wait for vacation. I feel like I wanna be colorful, bright, and comfortable. So this blazer over top of my bikini top with the jean shorts. I'm gonna pair it with um, those Gucci slides instead because I am running errands and I'm not gonna do that in heels. But it's such a fun look. I'm just, I'm just gonna keep it on. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. Everything was stuff that was in my closet. Even the swimsuit, I've had this probably about since March. I ordered it for my Puerto Rico trip and it didn't come in time. So I even had that a while. So you can definitely make these looks, get creative and do it with stuff that's in your closet. But if you would like these pieces, some of those, like I said, I've had for a while. Um, if it's still in stock, I will leave the link to it below, or if not and it's sold out, I will leave a link to something similar. If you have any questions about this look, if you have any questions about traveling for free, make sure you drop me a comment down below. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I'm so appreciative of every subscriber that I receive. <laughs> it warms my heart. But now it's time to go do some grocery shopping. So thank you babe for watching. Until next time.